Thanks, Wilson. 13 Lions swimmers have already qualified for the Tisca Swim Meet. Their next meet is Thursday, November 2nd against Mesquite ISD. The Lionettes volleyball team played their final game against Plano Senior on Tuesday night. They ended their season with a record of 5 and 10. A record-breaking game by Matt Gaddick led the Lions to victory last week against Plano East. Here's Riley Mulligan and I with the story. Concussions are a growing concern among MHS athletes. Sam Richards, Lexi Villarreal, and Sydney Beck highlight this common sports injury. The Lions basketball team beat Plano Senior on Tuesday night, clinching a playoff berth. They play Hebron in the first round of playoffs on Tuesday night. Football season may be over, but that hasn't stopped senior Gavin Beckley from pursuing his kicking career. Landry Amick brings us the story. The Lions basketball team plays Denton Geyer away tonight at 7.30. The wrestling season is well underway. Sam Richards, Sydney Beck, and Lexi Villarreal give us an update on the wrestling team. Thanks, Nick. The Lions basketball team beat Denton Geyer on Tuesday night. They play Plano East away tonight at 7.30. The Lions basketball team lost Denton Geyer on Tuesday night. They play Plano East tonight at home at 7.30. Sam Richards and Lexi Villarreal bring us an update on how the season's going. The Lions soccer team beat Plano West on Tuesday night. They play Plano Senior away tonight at 7.30. The Lionettes soccer team beat Plano West on Tuesday night. They play Plano Senior tonight at home at 7.30. That's all for sports. Now back to you. Thanks, Nick. The Lionettes swim team won against Lovejoy on Tuesday night. Here's an update on how the swim team is doing this season. Ashton Sullivan broke the school six dive list record, scoring 283 points. Congrats, AJ. The Lions and Lionettes basketball team started their season last week. The girls won against Frisco Liberty and the boys play tonight at the Colony High School. The Lions football team plays in the annual Crosstown Showdown tonight at 7.30 against Boyd. Coach Kaufman and Coach Cable give us a look at District 66A playoff hopes. Thanks, Nick. The Lions tennis team fell to Plano West on Tuesday. They ended their season with a record of 5-7. and seven. The Lionettes volleyball team defeated Boyd on Tuesday night for the first time since 2015. Winning three out of four sets, Sophie Manson led the offense with 15 kills and 21 assists, and Sadie Berg led the defense with 19 digs. The Lionettes play Plano East at home tonight at 5.30. The Lions football team defeated Plano Senior away last week, advancing the record to 5-0. Here's Logan Murphy and Aaron Klusman with the Lions progress. 